structure. Randy Howell here. We're ready to start the, uh, the first day of the Lake Erie, the last super tournament for FLW Series, and I'm excited about getting out here on this big smallmouth lake and trying to catch some big ones today. But we've got a lot of wind blowing, and that's the story this morning everybody's talking about, this long boat rides, having to make that long ride across Erie to get some good clean water. A lot of guys are going to St. Clair, which is like 80 miles away. I'm going to the Detroit River, which is about 50, 55 miles. And we get a short amount of time to fish when we get there and back, but the Yamamoto Shad Shaped Worm, Green Pumpkin's been catching them for me pretty good, and I'm drop shotting with my 7.3 Randy Howell Signature Series Tattoo Elite Dial with Spinning Rod. Been working good, so I'm looking forward to getting out there trying to make them bite, so y'all be watching. Hope we'll get out of here with a good finish and keep everything put together in these boats. So see you on the water, God bless. We just went through an hour and 25 minutes almost of torture. But the Triton Mercury and the TH Atlas Jack Plate all held together and got us here. We're the first one to get over here, I think, today. Now we gotta catch some fish. Never use the Triton cold seat unless it gets this bad, you can't stand up.
thick and red when it's a good one. I saw them on the graph drop right on. Bit it. Good, they're biting good enough to do that. Cat shaped worm, green pumpkin. Well, glad the day is over. Got back safely. I ran a little over 100 miles round trip today. Right, Mercury took a beating this morning, but and my seat, I said earlier, my seat broke in the, right in the middle. It just broke. The back fell back on me, and thankfully Kevin at the Triton service trailer, he gave me an extra throw cushion yesterday just for more cushioning in my compartments, and I'm glad I had it because that saved me. I put one behind my back, one behind the seat between the wall to kind of keep it from flattening all the way out, and I was able to make do and drive that hour and 20 minutes of brutality. <laughs> so, uh, we made it. Broke his seat, but we made it. We got where it needed to go and caught a couple big ones right off the bat. And I thought I was gonna catch 20 pounds. All the first three I caught were those four to four and a half pounders. And uh, then, then I struggled, man, to catch five. And I only caught two more, two pounder and about a pound three quarter. And that finished my limit out to give me right at 16 pounds. So I'm thankful to have that. Chad Shake Worm, Yamamoto, Green Pumpkin, that's my drop shot bait. Caught on all of my Randy Howell 7.3 uh, Tatula Elite drop shot rod. Didn't lose any, caught a bunch of shorts, and then those five good ones. So overall, good day considering the wind. So hopefully we'll have a chance tomorrow. And hopefully the wind won't blow bad tomorrow and I can get, get back over there. And uh, so I feel like I can catch some more big ones if I can get back over there. So we'll see. Can't wait. Stay tuned.